anything better than a Shop Disney haul? Yes, when you get the stuff on sale. <laughs> welcome back, Mouseketeers. If you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Christina Kay. I focus on Disney-related content here, and I love love a good haul. We have a Shop Disney haul today that I recently took advantage of because it was up to 25% off plus some sale items. Lots of goodies to share with you. Let's just get right into it. So many goodies for you. Let's start with the bags. Not like a Dooney and Burke bag. If you saw my collection videos, you'll know I have a lot of purses. A lot of purses and backpacks. A lot of collections. But this is different kind of stuff like packing cubes. I'm so excited about these. They are such nice quality. I am a big fan of packing cubes for my Disney trips, but like now I have Disney ones for my Disney trip. Yes, they are such amazing quality that I actually ordered some for my dad, for my boyfriend. They come with three. They come with a large one, a medium, and a small one. So these are very well made and for the 25% off price, like you couldn't beat that. So very excited about this find. I think it came out to like 16, maybe $18 with the sale. Yes, please. If you've never used packing cubes, I was a doubter of them and now I I am like the biggest supporter of them. I use them for my ears. I use them for everything that I pack. I use them. This I use a lot back home. Maybe not so much these days because I'm not going out shopping, but a reusable bag. And this is from a collection that I am such a big fan of, Ink and Paint. Oh, I love this line. And they just, as of today when I'm filming this, restocked a bunch of Ink and Paint merch. And I can't rave about the stuff enough. This is a beautiful bag. And if you can see, here we've got all the sketches in the back of some like very rare characters too. Some like, you know, like Pinocchio and Alice, but then you've got like the three caballeros and you've got um, the mice from Cinderella. You've got some really cool guys. And on the side, you have them in color. I love this. I totally regret not getting the backpack or the Dooney and Burke in this print because they're so, so nice. Oh, guys, oh, I'm so sad. I've been watching like you probably have been, all the Walt Disney World reopening stuff, and Splash Mountain has had the longest wait. It's been like five, 10 minutes for Flight of Passage, which is really just like walk on, but Splash Mountain's been like 35, 40 minutes, cause we don't know when it's going away. Also, four hour wait for the merchandise. What are these people doing with the merchandise? Like, I feel like they're gonna resell it on eBay, and I'm not about that. I'm really, I'm really just upset with what's going on with the Disney merch lately. Not like the quality of it, because it's been awesome, but how people are just like taking advantage of the stuff and reselling it on eBay. Like that's so heartbreaking to me. And now Disney's doing this like merch pass system. Have you gotten the email about that where you can sign up to like potentially win first grab at this merchandise? Guys, the Disneyland 65th merchandise is gonna be launching and I'm really nervous for that because mama wants spirit jersey and a couple of other things. This next thing was like a gift with purchase that you buy. So like if you spent, I think it was like $35 or $75, something like that. I spent it, whatever it is. Uh, it's discounted. So it was like $14 and I'm so excited about this. It is a cooler. It is bigger than I thought, but I'm okay with that. It's this Mickey cooler. How cute. It's so funny because one of the other YouTubers I watch, she said it was bigger than she thought too, but like we're both guilty of looking at measurements but I'm so okay with this because I bring a lot of like food to work sometimes I'll be there for like two meals or like snacks I'm a diabetic so I always like to have stuff with me and now I just have like another purse I have like my purse and then I have this and it's just insulated on the inside which I'm really excited about my last lunch bag was a cast member one I've had for a while and it got ruined so hopefully nothing happens to this it seems really durable and in good condition so I'm excited to use this plus I love this blue color yes I'm one of those people that when I pack my lunches it's not just in one bag it like trickles into another bag I think it should all fit in this I'm still working from home so you know I've got a lot of clothes here for you um, I am so into the Mickey like parts collection like we have with the um, packing cubes Wow um, I was really excited that they had them in a pajama set a woman's like thermal pajama set it's thermal but it's like a thinner thermal and it's a long sleeve but I was really in it for the shorts Oh yes, oh yes. I don't know if I will wear the long sleeves, and I know I've said that before about Disney pajamas, but I will definitely wear the shorts. They're thin enough, but like thick enough at the same time, if that makes sense. So maybe like a December Disney trip, I will bring those down for. Oh, they're so cute. Do you feel like this is strictly pajamas, or would you totally wear a long sleeve shirt like this, like back home? Thinking about it. 
We have a ton of t-shirts here, get comfortable. I feel like they brought back so many old school designs or stuff that was like similar to what they had back in the day. This, they definitely had a print of. I have the Walt Disney World purse uh, to prove it, but this is the Disneyland version of this shirt. Oh my goodness, so many favorite characters on here. I mean, we've got pirates. We've got Brer Rabbit hitchhiking ghosts like so much fun mr toad huey dewey and louie i'm absolutely obsessed with this print i did not go to disneyland back when this print was a thing i was only going to walt disney world at that time so i'm so excited to now have this print they didn't put any of the walt disney world uh, merch of this print out just this and i was like yep need to have it if you haven't seen my purse collection video did i say that already i was gonna link that up in the eye and down below because i totally have the walt disney world print of this in a purse you could check that out this is one that's just retro looking i don't think this ever was a print but i also have the disneyland version of this I didn't like the Walt Disney World one because it said Florida on the bottom and I sometimes, you know, have an issue with that. But this one just said Disneyland and like Goofy is just oh, so stinking cute. This looks really cute on too. This one said it was a men's shirt but it fit me wonderfully. I like downsize so I normally am like a large in women's and a medium in like men's or adults and it just honestly fit beautifully. I feel like the men's is the same as the adult sizing by the way. Ooh, the sun's all of a sudden shining through. What? She'd be bright. Ooh. This one I just thought was hysterical and I totally was like I don't need this but I, like I totally do. Profile pic, tag picked. Hashtag story of my life. I also really love this blue color. They're gonna go great with the Arendelle Aqua ears. <laughs> but I love Anna. She totally represents both parts of me and I I really connect with this shirt. <laughs> they had a bunch of kind of shirts like this and mugs like this where it was like before coffee and after coffee with Ursula. It was... <laughs> I think they did a great job with this line. And this is a little softer than these other t-shirts too, so I'm here for that. This one is actually a gift from my dad, but I had to show it. I'm like kind of trying to figure out if I want one too. We got him the Disneyland Mickey Winking, and they also have a Walt Disney World one of this as well. But I kind of like this Disneyland one, the placement of it. Mm. If you saw my box lunch haul a couple of months ago, I'll link that up in the eye down below. I have a skirt from Cakeworthy that I feel like this would be perfect with. Thinking about it. You know by me saying thinking about it, it's sitting in my cart right now. Yeah. This one, okay, I got this for my dad, but then I liked it so much better in person so that I had to order one for me and for my boyfriend. This, tell me this is not old school Disney. Yep. Like, I feel like I could have seen a design like this on, like, plates or something, right? I love this. It's so much nicer in person. The colors on it, everything. And they have a Disneyland one of this as well. This totally reminds me of the entrance to Walt Disney World. Like, you have, like, those four panels in the front or the two on the side. Oh, I'm, I'm not even making sense. I'm, like, both hungry and, like, really excited to go to the park right now. <laughs> Okay, a few more things here. And this was also a gift, but I figured I should show this because it's one of those things that, again, so much nicer in person than on the website. It is a magic band. This is a gift for me padre. He loves Woody. And I just felt like red is a classic color. It goes with so much. And look how cute Woody looks on this. And also, this part is so nice. The castle and then the Andy footprints. Um, can they please make a Buzz Lightyear one of this in blue? Not, not green, because I feel like they would do green and I won't wear green, but like I would love a solo Buzz Lightyear magic band. Okay, and then I want to showcase the masks. These I've actually been wearing, um, and I will say these are the most comfortable out of all the masks that I own. They do pick up, if you wear makeup though, a little bit easier with the makeup than some of the other ones, but I don't plan on wearing makeup with these. I think these are amazing. So we've got a couple of different sets here. The first one is the mouth set. So we've got a Mickey. And just for reference, I wear the adult size large. Some of these are still available on Shop Disney. Oh, this looks so funny right now. Some of these are still available on Shop Disney's website. They actually just added a bunch of sizes, like adult extra large and um, a bunch of youth sizes because they didn't have that beforehand. But I feel like the adult smalls, which I'll show you in just a second, could totally be used for kids but my mom and my sister are a little bit more petite than me they fit into the mediums my dad and I and my boyfriend fit into the larges no problem so in this set they sell them as four packs on shopdisney.com we've got Mickey then we've got Pooh 
Marie, which I was so happy they gave her some love. I see a lot of the um, Etsy shops are celebrating Marie as well. And Stitch. They also sell a goofy one like this in the parks, single. Um, in the parks, the way they're doing it is they're individually and you can mix and match which ones you want, four for 20, and they're just 20 like this prepackaged. Um, the Disney stores are reopening. I know there's the one here reopened and they do sell them at the Disney store as well. Okay, then we have a Pixar set here. Forky, yes. Then we've got this all over um, Pixar print, which is actually a lot nicer than I thought it was going to be online. And I feel like this will go with a lot. We've got a bunch of Pixar love here. Then we've got a solo Mike Wazowski. I wish they had like a Sully one too. And then another all over Pixar print. I wonder why they chose to do them in like this particular design. I'm okay with it, but I wonder. This set is probably my favorite out of all of them. It's the Mickey and Minnie set. I just feel like it's going to go with so much. We've got Mickey, classic Mickey there. And then Minnie. I've worn this one a lot and I have a couple of these. These are great because they are washable. They're reusable, which is nice. Minnie. And they have their washing instructions right on it so you don't have to be like how do i think i should watch this you know and then this one is probably going to be my most loved one of the bunch this just all over mickey prints the navy and the white love it i don't have the star wars in an adult i really need to get on that but i have them in a small here an adult small just so you can see now that was too too small for my sister and my mom and then it was too small for um an 11 year old too so just so you know but we've got the star wars print here and by an 11 year old i mean the coolest 11 year old out there shout outs to jake <laughs> Um, I'm gonna save that one for last. Then we've got this like old school vintagey print. This one had to happen. R2D2. I really need this one. This is like my favorite one of the bunch. That and it's tied with, you guessed it, <laughs> Baby Yoda. Everything is better with Baby Yoda. And then this Marvel set came as a four pack too, but I already gave my dad the Incredible Hulk one because I just don't do green. But we've got. All over, like comic y print. Captain America's on there. That's right. Iron Man. Guys, I miss Marvel movies so much. Oh. Black Panther. Have we had? We haven't had one this year. Ugh. Oh. Depression. And then this one, which if Comic Con's still going on, this will probably be the one I wear. Just this all over Marvel logo. So that is my shop, Disney Haul. As we speak, there's more being shipped to me, but we'll do that in a collective haul. I have some amazing finds to show you, some places I've never talked about before and I'm busting to tell you about. So that's probably gonna come either next week or the following week. So make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any of my videos. I still have more collection videos on the way. I've already done a ton. I will link the playlist down below. There's like everything from ears to spirit jerseys to purses to backpacks to magic bands to mugs it's just all of it my most recent one was jewelry no nope, my most recent one was pins well they were both pretty recent i will put those down below i actually have a pin tag coming this week if you don't want to sit through that long pin collection video i, I just don't blame you <laughs> there's a lot um so we're going to celebrate 20 years of pin trading with a tag also i've done like tj maxx hauls with disney finds and actually as we speak my sister is there again picking me up some disney stuff and we got problems in this family. That is the K Disney way. <laughs> but thank you so much for joining me. Please subscribe. Let me know down below what was your favorite item or what have you seen on Shop Disney that you either are hoping to get or you got or maybe you just received recently and you're so excited about. I would love to know in the comments down below. Of course, you can hit me up on Instagram too. I will put that down below. Thanks for joining me. I hope you are doing well wherever you are and staying safe. I am Christina K. Have a Disney day. Do you feel like it's too soon for Disney to reopen? I was just um, seeing that Hong Kong Disneyland is actually going to shut down because of the COVID cases rising. And I feel like maybe Walt Disney World uh, may be coming next. I don't know, but let me know in the comments below. Is it too soon? Are you headed down there? Are you currently down there? And if you are, why are you watching this? Soak up the magic. <laughs>